Metalheads, welcome to Graphic Metal, where metal is celebrated with design in mind. You all out there probably have figured out how much we love the underground scene and painstakingly take the time to research, collect, and support and celebrate the small bands. But without the big, there are no small. Both are needed for the other to flourish. The problem is rock and metal, as with most of entertainment these days, has struggled to see new bands rise to that level. Hell, ever notice that over the past 30 years, the same headliners are the same on repeat? <clears throat> Slater? How is your retirement? It gets you when you least expect it. You know what I mean? Yeah. That's the best time. <laughs> but the time for these legendary acts, they're coming. And soon. And when 90% of all the big name acts are pushing 60 plus more, Let's just say we might be seeing a lot of holograms or doomed to only hear metalcore. Unless something changes quickly. That's where bands like Ghost come in. <laughs> Graphic Mel decided to take a trip to the Ministry of Ghost to see if we can discover any clues as to how they did it. This will be a multi-episode series because we believe they are vital to the future. Also because they are an excellent showcase to the power of design, vision, and effort. There's gotta be something there. 